Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome to another reaction video. Today we're going to be checking out Joe Rogan. I think I've only done one Joe Rogan video on my channel and it was with Andrew Schultz. It was a clip from the from his podcast and it was literally hilarious. I could not stop laughing. I almost didn't upload the video because it was so inappropriate and disgusting, but I had to. It was just so insanely funny. So if you want to see that video, I'll link it down below. Today we're watching The Sex on Game of Thrones is way better on TV than it is in the books. Before we get started, if you're new here, hi, my name's Camilla. I make mostly reaction videos. I like laughing. So if you have any suggestions for things you want me to watch, leave them down in the comments. And also, if you like my channel and you want to support my channel, there's ways you can do that down in the description. But let's get right into it. Joe Rogan's The Sex on Game of Thrones is way better on TV than it is in the books. Let's go. I love the show, The Game of Thrones, but I hate everybody who read the books. It's weird. It's a conundrum. I don't hate that they read the books. I hate that they have to tell me they read the books. You know, there's one of those things that people do where they tell you they've read the book just to let you know that they read. You know? Yeah. They always say the same thing. You're like, oh, Game of Thrones is the best show. They go, the book's even better. Uh, no, it's not. It's never better to not see something, you fuck. I know what you're doing. <laughs> you just want me to know you read the book. Oh, the book's better, really. I watch the show. I see naked people have sex and then sword fight to death. And you're sitting there with your eyes go, oh, I could only imagine what that would be like. <laughs> mm, it's better if I don't even see. Mm. <laughs> fuck you, you fake smarty pants. I know exactly what you're doing. Fake ass smarty pants. And it's so transparent. It makes you go, mm. but you can't say anything. You're like, mm. Mm. They also do it when they tell you about they're vegan. That's one of the things that people do. They sneak it in. Well, you know, as a vegan, I feel, oh, well, I've only known you for a minute. Amazing. Yeah, that happens so much. It it's like they're holding their breath when they meet you. <gasps> Boom, I'm a vegan. Woo! Glad I got that out so I could start talking about my diet. It's almost like the plants hypnotize them. Like if you eat enough <laughs> plants, they go. This is their identity. <laughs> Let them know the benefits. You are spiritually rich. You are better than them. You are far more awesome. Well, as a vegan, as an awesome person, I feel, they get all bendy. And then it's like, <laughs> I'm not threatening, and I'm eating vegetables only. I'm different than anyone else you know. Why are they so ridiculous? Why, why is this true? Why does this annoy people? And it doesn't annoy me about most people. There's a lot of people that are vegan that are great. But it's the 10% that are annoying as fuck that are worth talking about. You know? And what is wrong with them? Why do they say such silly shit? It's really simple. They don't get enough nutrients. They don't realize what they're saying is silly. You need cholesterol to form your own opinions, all right? They say ridiculous shit that's easy to refute. Like, here's the big one that vegans love to say. So if this ever comes up, please feel free to use this. Do you know that humans are the only animal that drink the milk of other animals? Yes, they oh, always say this. so crazy. You know what else only people do? Fly planes. <laughs> make movies. <laughs> call each other on the phone and tell each other how awesome milk is. What? The fuck kind of goofy ass point is that? That is so poorly <laughs> thought out. Are you trying to say that other animals don't want milk? You ever give your dog a bowl of milk? He's like, dude, where the fuck did you get this shit? Yeah. He doesn't stop and go, hey man, is this organic, free range dog milk? Because if it's not, <laughs> off, pig. No. <laughs> your, dog, your dog can't believe it's cold. How is it cold when it's warm outside? Are you a wizard? <laughs> your dog would eat a bowl of dog assholes if you put it in his bowl, right? This, this idea that it's a moral quandary. Oh, uh, should I drink milk? No, they're too fucking dumb to farm. That's what's going on. Oh, man, you know, you think you're funny, you know? Tell all the jokes you want, but milk is bad for you. Milk causes cancer. I got news for you. If you get cancer from milk, you're a fucking pussy. Okay? <laughs> My grandfather ate cigarettes and he lived to be a thousand. Bob died. He was only 25. What happened? Dairy. Bro, he was eating yogurt. He died. He died doing what he loved. Died, guy lived Stupid. On they don't eat honey. 
That's how you know vegans are completely ridiculous. The real hardcore vegans, they don't eat honey, and they, they love to say this. Well, you can, but I don't. Oh, thank you so much! I didn't <laughs> have honey! But I'm still below you, though, right? Mm. Mm. Oh, you're better! Honey! Fucking honey! You don't have to kill to get honey. You just take it with smoke. You blow smoke on them, and you take it. That's it. They don't even know it's gone. They don't even get mad. And this motherfucker was like, you really think it's cool those bees just work for people? <laughs> okay, yeah, it's kind of fucked up, right? Because you know what bees do when they're not making honey? Nothing! They don't have other jobs. It's not like they're on their way to bee stunt driving school and they got kidnapped and forced to work in the white man's honey factory. No. They're cunty little shitty bugs with one job. They make honey, and they only live to be a week. They only live a week. They die of old age. Oh, I didn't week. know that. And they die doing everything. I didn't they know that. They sting you, and the male honeybee has sex. His dick breaks off, and he bleeds out. That is literally nature telling you to go fuck yourself. <laughs> I don't see it that way, man. I don't fucking see it that way, okay? I think of all animals in the universe as unique and individual and equal and when I see a penis dying I feel the same way as if a loved one is passing and I see this noble bee and I'm like noble bee you stung even though you knew you were going to die why did you do it and the bee's like I saw a baby next to me in the grass and I was like fuck that baby <laughs> <laughs> Team people, bitch. Team people. The reason why we're still here is someone way smarter than you figured out how to steal honey with smoke. My God, you silly fuck. Agave tastes like shit. It tastes like <laughs> shit. You stop. It's bad it for does. you, does. And by the way, what's all this naming shit? Like vegan chicken. Vegan chicken? You're eating vegan chicken? Yeah, I know. You know chicken's an animal and you got to kill it to eat it? Why don't, isn't that what you don't want to do? Why are you pretending your plant is an animal that you killed? Being a vegan and eating <laughs> chicken, that's like being a pediatrician that likes to kick rubber babies. What, what's your fucking weird end game here, man? Why are you yeah. eating that vegan ice cream? It is vegan ice cream. No, 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 it's not. No, 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 no. Ice cream has cream in it. Cream is from fucking cows, dummy. You can't have vegan ice cream. You need to make a new noise with your face that means that shit, okay? There's no cream in it. You're a liar. What you have is some frozen tofu bullshit that tastes like sadness, all right? <laughs> I like Joe Rogan. I like his uh, ideas and his thoughts and his op opinions. They're awesome. So he's awesome. And yeah. I agree with a lot of that stuff. When I see the ingredients that are on the vegan foods, like the vegan patties, the vegan sausages, vegan, you know, whatever, bacon, all that stuff, the vegan mayonnaise even, vegan eggs, the amount of ingredients and chemicals that they have to put in all that stuff to get it going to be similar to what the actual thing is, is like crazy. I just, yeah, no thank you. No thank you. But that was funny. Joe Rogan is the boss. If you like this video and you want to support my channel, please check out the description. But thanks for watching with me. Thanks for hanging out. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.